Wait, smell it. It smells like medicine. Oh. I don't know if I can eat this. Very chewy. <laughs> it's very chewy. So far, a case with a 50 is just nasty. Ew. Do you think they taste better or worse than the life I got prune. Oh. Prune? prune. <laughs> Teach me how to smoke, guys. No! <laughs> oh. 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 Why is it salty? It's salty. <laughs> Whoa! Retro candy from the 50s. Now last time the kids and David tried candy from the 30s, so make sure to check out that video. 50s is one of my favorite eras that if I could go live in the 50s, I probably would, because I think it was so fun, like poodle skirts, all the bands, the poodle skirts, the boys with their white shirts and rolled up sleeves, and <laughs> the fashion. I love the fashion and even the music, like the rock and roll star. Is that what Elvis was? Yes. Elvis. 50s songs. That was our, so fun. That was our grandparents. Yes. I, would, I think that would be a generation I'd pop back to. It would be fun. All right, so we're going to try some of the treats from the 50s and see if we like the treats. So Let's these are the most popular candies in the 50s wow. and some of the popular ones that came before the 50s but were still like popping. Okay, first off the bat, we oh. see satellite wafers. Okay, we've got some fun these facts about these bad facts. Have you guys tried them before? Yes. yes. Uh, so it's gross. basically like a paper, uh, candy paper. That's it's just paper. Wrapped around what? I don't know. So, candy beads? It's, so the, people call them flying saucers, and they're unique UFO-shaped paper-like wafers filled with sugar and colorful small candies. I think I need to show it close up. It does taste like paper, like you're eating paper with like, like citric acid inside. Yeah, I think it has a thing going down the middle. So. As many people claim the wafer part of the candy oh tastes gosh. like cardboard, but it's the inside that causes curiosity and offers enjoyment. It literally oh. it does taste like <laughs> I don't know if you can see, but... I think it's fun. I think it's novelty. Oh, wait. Hey, novelty the trick, cardboard. The trick to get them. past the cardboard is... Dude, like, just lick it. Break just it lick open. It. And then you okay, the cardboard inside. doesn't taste so good. <laughs> Do, have you never tried these? I've had this cardboard stuff, but not on the... I don't yeah. think I've had these. I don't know. So, I just <laughs> broke it off. And That's what you need to do. Just tear it off. But then it's just like sprinkles. I mean, it's edible, but it is. It's it like is. sprinkles inside. Cardboard and sprinkles. Mm -hmm. It's a full experience. experience. That oh, is the that. cheapest to make candy and probably the most profitable. Um, it, says, it literally even says edible on the top. Probably because people don't know how to eat them because they're so different and unique. Ugh. I don't know what that's made out of, if it's made out of like rice paper. Flying sauces. They really are unique. Thumbs down. It's a cute idea, but one. they should have made it flavorful. Nasty. I'm trying to eat. Uh, I mean, it melts your mouth at it least. It does actually, after a while. Enjoy your Here, you can have that one too. It's not bad. Okay, next candy. We gotta try this bowl thing. Okay, try the roll. What is this? Like okay, so this is Garrett's Broadway Strawberry Rolls. Oh, also, we learned in the 50s that they started advertising for Halloween. They hated it really hard. Before that was Christmas and, what was it, Easter? I don't know. I, was in I think it was Christmas and Easter. Oh, wait, in the 50s, they started really advertising hard for Halloween with candy, and so candy became more popular in the 50s. Yeah, it became part of pop culture. Okay, well this doesn't oh. have fun facts about it, so we just gonna give what our What is fingers. that? There's I've like never seen that in my life. Strawberry roll? I haven't either. It's, it's like strawberry licorice. roll. Show, show what it is like once you take it out of the package. That looks, it reminds me like of a fruit. fruit. Loop. No, not fruit. Foot fruit long. Fruit roll roll up. Roll it down. Yeah, roll it, it open and look. There's also oh, it smells long. good. Oh, oh, you break like it into smell. chunks? There's four pieces. Yeah, there's four pieces. It's like a fruit roll up. Look, why don't we have these nowadays? Maybe it's because it is. Wait, smell it. It smells like... Medicine! Do you Wait, are, you to, are you supposed to like rip it like this? I don't know if I can eat this. You gotta have to try this it. This smells like this smells like, like chocolate. Chocolate. Oh, yeah, you're probably supposed to like take a little bit off. Yeah, I think I think you're supposed to unroll it so you try like the little strings, like che string cheese. Oh, why is it so terrible? Yeah, I got a little bit more. Alright, great to eat. I'm gonna pop it in! Three, two, one. Very chewy. <laughs> it's very chewy. So far, a case with a 50 is just nasty. It does not have a good flavor. I'm sorry, grandparents. This is what you had to go through. What happened to all the good candies from the 30s? Ew. Okay, I see why this no longer exists. But it kind of tastes something familiar. Licorice. Mm, yeah, it's kind of like licorice. It's like 
when licorice first got invented, but then they perfected it. Ew. This is like the grossest licorice ever. The okay. prototype. You're done. Oh, not the big thing. That's a thing. I think that has penis, does it? Oh. Yep. No, we can try no, it. You got to eat it. <laughs> you get peanuts. Okay, I'll give you some fun facts while you eat it. I remember having these in Mom high school. It. Okay, Ty gets half a bar. I don't even know where you, bar. can you find these in the stores? All right. Look. Big honk. Mm -hmm. Are peanuts wrapped in honey flavored nougat? Yeah, if it's all you. Oh, maybe like a candy store. Like maybe. a store just full of candy. Some people enjoy oh, eating yes. it frozen while breaking big hunk candy bar into pieces. Others love the chewy nugget texture and prefer it as is. We did not freeze it, so we're having it as is. This oh. is what it looks like. That's what it looks like. It has little chunks in it. It's kind of like mm. the inside nougat of a. Okay, so we're gonna just try to break up a. It's all you. Piece. Just try a little oh, tiny bag. Why does that look like Play Doh? I ate. Play Doh. No, no. Oh. Don't oh. no wonder yeah. why. Oh, God. I ate these in high school. Did you like them back then? Yeah. Is it good now? Yeah. Okay, I like it at all. It actually tastes really good. I peanuts right now. Yeah. So Jake and I are not trying this because we're both allergic to peanuts. I just don't feel like peanuts right now. <laughs> Ty's not in the mood for peanuts. I like it. I get to pick the next candy. Charms. What's charms? I don't know. That. It looks like square lifesavers. All right, I don't have fun facts about this, so let's just try it. Oh, oh it does oh, look oh. like. Somebody's breath. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, it does look like. Oh, but it's not like all the way tall on the inside. Show you, show off your beauty guru. <laughs> I know, right? Charms. So the inside is not hollow, but it is square. These are actually kind of fun because they're novelty because you can't ah. get square lifesavers. Yeah, they literally are square lifesavers. Do you think they taste better or worse than the lifesaver? I got prune. Oh, prune? prune? Wait, what? It's gross. <laughs> what flavors are these? Prune? Mine does not taste that good. Prune lifesaver would be the worst These are the thing. healthy lifesavers. Here, try it. Try the wait. Wait, the prune. This is this the one purple, purple grape. Mine's lime. Mine's purple, yeah. but it's prune. I think that doesn't say apple. the flavors. Oh well, mine is not lime. I got, I got prune flavor. I have no clue what this prune? is. Prune. I've never heard of prune flavored candy. I think it's probably grape. <laughs> that is not grape. Grape is nasty. What is this like, flavor? This ain't grape. I like that. I need something to spit this out. It's gross. I like that there's not like a I've never hole in the this middle. Ever. I have no clue what I'm tasting. Nice lime and it's delicious. Green? Thumbs up. I don't like these flavors. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs down. Up. My flavor is nasty. So far, this has not been a win. This <laughs> box is like not as great as the 30s it's box. Good. It's really fun to try though. I'm Whoa! Twin cherry. These are cool. Wait, is it more than one? No. no. I have never seen this candy before. These are called twin cherries. And it literally looks like a cherry. That is so cute. Let's open it up and get a better look at it. Oh my gosh. Oh, wait, it's just like one big lollipop, kind of like broken in half. That is that's so cute. Here you go. Are you, are you it's a baby pop. Okay, let's try our cherry. Is it just a sucker? What was that? <laughs> it tastes like it has a numbing agent in it. I just say cough agent. syrup. This this cherry flavor is quite interesting. <laughs> it doesn't taste bad, but it does give me slight medicine vibes. It only gives me medicine vibes. <laughs> medicine yeah, I don't like medicine flavored candy, like Here, the cherry flavor. No. Mmm, <laughs> delish. Okay, next up we're trying. Uh, what are we trying, Ty? The honeys. Just it honeys. looks like. I don't know if there's peanuts well, in it. Well, it says soothing honey center. They're honey filled drops. I'm not sure what to expect of these. I've never seen these before. Where does this. Because obviously, like, this is candy from the 50s and it didn't go out. Like, people are still making it because it's in this yeah, box. Where are they? This candy is literally from maybe the 50s. Maybe you're able to. Like, Maybe you're able oh. to request it. Yeah, where do you get this candy? Okay, honey? why why are all these candies giving oh. medicine though? This looks like a cough drop. It's just like it like a little, literally looks like a Jolly Rancher cough drop. Is this oh, wait? Is this just honey? No, it says honey filled. <laughs> and honey is what you eat when you're sick because it helps you sort through. It does look like a cough drop kind of candy. So oh why do you have the like, fifties were obsessed with their medicine flavored <laughs> candies? Maybe it's not so good to be in the fifties. Better girls. I thought I heard fizzing noises. I thought that was coming from Audrey, but it was the washing machine. It is Jolly Rancher shaped though, but it also cough medicine. We're all eating it. It just tastes like a subtle honey flavor. That's it. Yeah. yeah. But we have to get to the middle. Is it liquid? Only one that? way. 
Somebody buy that. Oh, you did. So it's supposed to be honey Whoa, in the milk. Yeah, that's honey. Oh, it's honey. This also turns into like sweet? glass shards in my mouth. <laughs> it's good, but it's different. That is very different. I bet that would be good for when you have a sore throat, because yeah. honey helps your sore throat. Just Healthy candy. It. I think that would be that, like that's a, a thumbs up. I like it. I've used that as medicinal, so we're saving that for <laughs> half drops. <laughs> I just eat it. My yeah. thumbs it up for medicinal purposes, cause but not for candy. Mm -hmm. Next up, we're trying candy cigarettes. Maybe. Victory. But a different brand. They tried some candy cigarettes in the 30s. It's bubble gum. It's not actually cigarettes. It just looks like the packaging. Yeah. yeah the yeah. packaging is that this little white candy sticks. Now I oh. remember these from my childhood. These are not like candy sticks. They're bubble gum. So. Oh, we got bubble gum? Oh, they look oh. like bubble gum! They look like cigarettes! <laughs> I know we have these kinds. The Whoa! These actually look like more Audrey. realistic than the candy ones. They're wrapped in a piece of paper, wax paper, and inside <laughs> is bubble gum. So you can walk around being like, oh, I'm so cool. Mom, you're pulling it wrong. I'm so cool. <laughs> I've never smoked a cigarette. So. I wonder why they got rid of these. <laughs> I, know, I can only imagine. Okay. Okay, so you peeled yours off? I got orange. I kind of just like. <laughs> Mom, you have the wrong way step. She's so eating the nasty end of like the, the ashes. ashes. <laughs> the ashes. Oh, yummy. <laughs> Teach me how to smoke, guys. No! <laughs> That's gonna get like clipped out and. Used the wrong way. I got it's gray. Like teasy. I don't know. I got gray. You got gray. Mine's orange. Oh, okay, it's different flavors. That's kind of fun. Right. It's a good gum. I don't though. encourage this kind of candy though. Right. I got. I got orange. normal bubble gum. Oh, Pixie Stick Orange. But the cowboys in the shows that I watched as a kid, because there's a lot of cowboy shows. They it's all right. had like their cigarettes, and so right. you're like. Because smoking was very popular when I was a kid. You could I smoke could everywhere in public. I could have never lived back then because you could smoke inside, yeah. and I would have like literally. Yeah. Like it was normal. You could see people smoking it in a restaurant or in a mm -hmm. store. Audrey, it's never. Not you, with my asthma lungs. But like, if you wanted to look like a cool cowboy celebrity, like you needed your candies and cigarettes as a kid. Now I see how terrible that is that they marketed to children. It's so. As a kid, I didn't know. Wow, that gum actually is decent flavor. It's not yes. nasty. Like I like some that one. Gum. The grape is alright. The orange is good. I don't normally like. I, I didn't. It's better than the charms. We're gonna go with the classic. Yes. You guys have had these. The candy necklace. I could see this coming out in the 50s and be a super cool. Mm -hmm. and then, like, We've like, all had these. I don't know how we're all gonna share one. Here, <laughs> simple. Yeah. You break the string. Have yep. you guys ever had these before? Everyone has. But it doesn't look like this. These are like birthday party treat classics. Wow. Yeah. I or see like some. Or like the school treat thing. It's just you know? sugary. But we that's gotta a try fun. this. Classic, classic one. candy. Why is salt what are we trying next? Pumpkin so, seeds a candy. Yeah. Pumpkin seeds? We got salted pumpkin seeds. That's more of a I snack. got no facts on this one. I don't know why that's a Here, candy. Here's uh, my opinion on it though. Well, that's more of a snack. It is it's like snack. the airplane salted almonds. I mean, I do love myself some good pumpkin seeds, <laughs> but this is like the salt. It's like almond. powder. Why is it like powdered sugar? Is it all salt it on the outside? <laughs> what? Is this just a bunch oh! of salt? Why is it salty? It is salty. Whoa! All this powder you see on it is salt. Oh yep. my! It is. <laughs> Whoa! Actually, wow, that's salty. Delicious. That's Wait, that is this? I got fresh. It's delicious. That's very salty. That's the best thing we've had this whole box. Pumpkin Audrey, really I know you love your salt. Holy moly. This is your salt intake for the day. Yeah, I mean, oh, that burns my mouth because of the salt. Wait, let me have some. Audrey's going to be ordering this now. I am going to be buying this in bulk. Those are extremely salty 50s pumpkin seeds. We they don't these. make them that salty now. No. They're like puffer, they're like all white. All you can taste is oh, salt. Lord. You cannot taste any pumpkin. I, I licked it all. Back that would best. be actually really good for a sore throat too because all the salt on your throat would probably help burn it away. I don't really like that one. That's the thumbs down for me. Double thumbs up. Double thumbs up. <laughs> what one are you going for? A lot of these other candies, why we're sorting through them is because they're classics that you can still find today, so they're not unusual. We're trying this vanilla Oops. Turkish taffy. So this to me looks like the big, um, they're not laffy taffies, but they're those big ones and they come in kind of the waxy type paper and they're banana flavored and they're really long. Do you know what I'm talking about? 
Yeah. This is just has corn syrup, mono and diglycerides, That's healthy. Egg whites. How would you eat all of those though? Natural and artificial Peanuts. flavor. So it contains like eggs. Right? Basically, this is made out of eggs. It's Let's an egg bar. It's, it's made in a factory. It's an egg Peanuts, candy. Though. It's, it's kind of like a egg whites whipped and then just until it's taffy. <laughs> I don't know. Mom, we got candy at home. The candy at home. I'm not sure what to think about this one because there is no like flavoring to it. So it's just basically egg whites made into egg whites and sugar maybe? It didn't even say sugar on the ingredients. She's using her teeth! That's nasty! It's all yours! I didn't touch it. I only touched the cardboard. Sure! It's all yours. I only touched the cardboard. We don't share germs. I only touched the cardboard. I want the very Ew. opposite side. Give me the very opposite Ew, side. What is the smell? It's egg whites. That's all it's like. It's all yours. Try it's right. right. Audrey, it's all yours. Just take a bite Do out of it. Do you need a knife? Just elbow me in the face. <laughs> no, we all gotta try it. Do I need to go get scissors? I can do it! Don't touch it. You can't <laughs> touch everybody. It's gonna elbow me in the face. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> I'm getting some. Here you go. No, we all Give have to do that. Give me half of that. Oh, this is actually pretty good. Wait, you're eating it? This is actually pretty nice. I'll eat these egg whites any day. <laughs> Wait, these egg whites? It tastes like cake mix. It's vanilla. That's what that's what the taste well, is. Oh, I realized why mine was so hard to buy into. This cardboard. This cardboard in the back. <laughs> it's so like pop. It's so chewy. It's gonna rip oh. anything off of my teeth. Do you have caps on your teeth? Don't eat braces. braces. Oh. oh my gosh, it's so chewy. It mm. tastes like sugar and egg whites. That's hey, this would be one like way to remove mix. braces. Thumbs up. <laughs> It's weird. Thumbs to the side. Oh, I got them. Okay, so we're gonna go through the rest of this candy real quick and show you what's in the box. So there are these little candy buttons. <sighs> which They're not we, good. I think they Nasty. tried them in the 30s. Did you try them in the 30s box? No, the sour, sour candy. Box. The sour oh, candy. Oh, and our sour candy video. So we did a video where it was last to leave eating sour candy and they had sour it's version of these. This is basically like cake frosting daubed onto a piece of paper and... And let's just say the sour version wasn't sour. Then we have the Chico Sticks, which is peanut butter, it's toasted, it's crunchy, it's delicious. It's the 30s candy. It's kind of like... It's so yummy, I tried it. It's kind of like the center of a Butterfinger. It's a Butterfinger. Without the chocolate and the yummy bit. Fun dip. Yeah. <laughs> we have a giant Smarties. Those are good. These though wreck your mouth by the time you get done with a giant. Oh, those one. are so good. They're so they destroy good. your mouth. Um, you Mike and mouth. Ike's. There's we Payday. Double mint. Boston baked beans. Mentos. Ooh, but I don't like Mentos in the mint. I like them in the rainbow. Tootsie Rolls, which is one of my favorites. I love Tootsie Rolls. Swedish Fish are always so good. Classic. Lifesavers, which is interesting that they have those plus the square charms. Right now. Hot tamales. That is a classic 30s and 50s. We're that trying that one. That burns your mouth. We're trying the hot tamales. Okay. And then in here, the rest is a bunch of hard oh. candy. Smarties, a little fake candy cigar, clove gum that numbs your mouth. They tried this in the 30s. So you know you what? See it. I'm gonna take one of these before I eat the Red Hot candy. Yeah, give me one as well. The rest, I'll sh I'm gonna show you this mix of hard candy because this totally reminds me of my grandparents' house. How there would always be like these little hard wrapped candies or just hard candies sitting in little candy dishes. They had candy dishes. They would sit around their house and. Um, There'd be hard candy there, which we never, we don't have like candy dishes. That's kind of a thing of, I think that's a 50s thing, a thing of the past 70s. Well, it became part of the pop culture. So. But there is this weird candy right here. What is that? It looks like there's stuff in it. Check that. That one was out. in the 30s yeah. too. So hot, did try there's it? actually a hotter version than hot tamales, like and it's called hot tamales fire. Uh, I would not like that. This candy from the 1950s became the top selling candy in America. In 1999. Hot tamales this was, was in 99 the top selling. I think they're pretty good. Okay, pass them down. Take one down, pass around. I do remember like when I was in high school the cinnamon toothpicks became popular. Oh, so that was more of the take one. 80s. Hot. That numbing gum really helps. <laughs> yep. Those are very hot. I yeah. don't like those anymore, but as a kid, I would have loved them. But that's something that reminds me, like, in my childhood, you'd always get, like, all your little candy in little boxes. That's so cute. <laughs> and, like, lemon drops and kind of, like, runts or something. Yeah. There's, and your Mike and Ike's. They're all, like, always in little boxes. Anyway, we're actually going to visit David and my childhood in the next retro candy, as we're oh. going to be trying 70s candy. Yeah! 
excited to try that to see if it does bring back some childhood memories. I'm hoping they have some of the stuff back then, but make sure to check out that video if you want to hear some stories about our childhood <laughs> with candy. I want to hear. Alrighty, that is it for today. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye.